What's going on guys, your boy Donzilla, and I'm back with another video. So we're gonna be continuing playing Bully. Uh, I fixed my audio so you can hear my sweet, sweet voice. Let's get to it. Oh. oh man. This is weird, bro. Chill. The principal has informed me of some drawings in the boys' washroom. Apparently, the sense of detail shows real promise. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Looks like you're having difficulties today. All right, you feckless maggots. We'll be playing dodgeball for the next while. Ah, dodgeball. How I love the sound of boys crying in the morning. Much like real life, the strongest will prevail. All right, you lazy bums. Look alive. I want everyone to give yeah, the best. Jimmy Hopkins delivers. There you are. Come on, I found something incredible. Hold on, relax, man. I can't keep getting in trouble. I can't get expelled again. It's always about me with you. Me, me, me. I'm thinking bigger picture. And you're worrying about getting into trouble? You know what? You really are something. What bigger picture? I'm... Uh, we are gonna take over this school. We are not taking over anything right now. Time and tide wait for no man, my friend. But it seems they do wait for a wannabe tough guy who's nothing but a little girl. You're full of it. So you keep telling me, look, now come on, I promise you, after this, things are never going to be the same again. Oh, I'm so excited. I should have stopped taking those pills ages ago. Yeah, right. Whatever you say, Gary. Move it along, punk. Hey, idiot! 
chance. Jimmy, stop calling her that crap, Frank. Jimmy, are you hurting yet? Just fighting. Would you hurry there, Jimmy? That cage wasn't locked before. Here, follow me. Uh, not that full health. We can't get in there. How can we get at the switch? Would you hurry there, Jimmy? <laughs> Now here's another switch I used to... Whoa! Heats up again. Oh, that's good. All right, let's get it. So, Jimmy Boy, here we are. The hole. The place where this school separates the men from the boys, the wheat from the chaff, and all that nonsense. Okay, so what's that got to do with standing up to people, keeping them in line? This is where I stand up to you, my friend. What are you talking about? I know you hate me, Jimmy boy. I know you said all that stuff about me behind my back. What are you talking about? Don't play innocent with me. You want to run this school? I want to run this school. Only one of us is going to make it. And it's going to be me. Go beat that little jerk who said that nasty stuff to me about your mom and those barnyard animals. Be quiet, bro. Be quiet. Russell wants vengeance. Hell no, bro. All right, now I gotta beat his ass, man. No, no, you cheat. No, you cheat. I'm gonna tear you apart. Come on, kick his ass.
lay your hands, get it. Let's get it. What are you talking about? Oh, shout out to the sub. Appreciate you. Uh, who was that? You happy now, jerk? Ecstatic. I love to watch two morons beat the crap out of each other. Why'd you do it, Gary? I thought we were friends. <laughs> friends? You and me. I've taken dumps that had more brains than you, friend. No. I'm taking over this school. And you're just a liability. See you around, moron. Well done, Jimmy. Yeah, great. What a waste of time. You all right, Russell? Oh. Yeah? Look, I never said anything about your mom or farmyard animals. You did it? No, but I want you to stop bullying weak kids. <laughs> Why? Ah, because there are a bunch of kids around this place who need a beating, and you're picking on the few who don't. So I want you to leave me and him alone. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> Bad Russell. Bad Russell. <laughs> With Russell pacified, I could be forgiven for thinking my troubles at Bullworth were over. Chapter 2. But this place is a rotten onion. Open the gates. Peel off one stinking layer, and there's another even smellier one beneath. Rich Kid Blues. Alright, y'all, let's get it. Probably gonna do like one more. Damn. Let's see how far. Well, Jimmy, word on the street is you're something of a pugilist. No, sir, I never pugilized in my life. Really? And that you've been saying some entertaining things about me and some barnyard animals? No, I never said that. Well, I listen to things, Hopkins. You try and stay out of trouble. Now go see the cook down in the kitchen. Helping her might teach you some humility. Okay, sir. Hey, new kid. That guy that beat up Russell. So? What's it to you? Hey, listen, we like to box the noble art and all that. Why don't you come down by our gym in old Bullworth Vale? You should definitely hang out. Yeah, I've heard a lot of things about you. Yeah, whatever. Okay. <laughs> How old is it? <laughs> yeah, I had a lot of things about you. Yeah, okay, whatever, buddy. Good job. Okay. Blue sweater above my face. Jim, go stand over by the bike workstation. Wait, I don't get to work on cars? Cars are for seniors. You gotta walk before you can run, boyo. I guess you're not useless. Shutting up and working? It works. You're showing promise, Hopkins. Easy. Easy work. It's easy when you know how. <laughs> Say it like that. I said I'd do it. Of thieving jerks. What's up, Melvin? Ah, greetings. Jimmy, listen. Some ruffians took it upon themselves to steal my grottos and gremlins character sheets and won't return them. We're playing tonight. The whole situation is untenable. Grottos and gremlins? Well, you are sad. Sad? I'm distraught. Role playing is the high point of human achievement. In fact, Upon reflection, I am prepared to offer a bag of groats to the fair knight, whomsoever recovers these precious screens. Do you accept the quest? How much? Ten groats. What? <laughs> I mean ten bucks. Wait here. And you can have your pick of my wenches. Great. <laughs> what?
This is the funnest piece of paper I've ever had. What? You forgot your plus speedy. Hey, that's cheating. Hey, what's with the unfair fighting? Stop that. Hey, that's cheating. I'll hang on to that. Oh, come on. There's no such thing as magic. Oh, no. I can use that. help us. Alright, you've got something of Melvin's. Give it up. All right, I'll give it to you if you beat my friend in a little game. He kicks you in the nuts, and you kick him in the nuts until one of you gives up. If you win, you get the sheep. If not, we keep it. What? That's just stupid. Exactly. Maybe, but I go first. <laughs> That's some funny stuff right there. Okay, you win. My funny is good. You recovered my precious documents. Thank you, sir. You are a noble man indeed. Just give me the money, Melvin. I'm saying. You have earned it. And don't forget about the witches. Holy moly. Who has time for a real job? Job well done. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Out. Stop, Gary. <clears throat> I'm trying to watch this. Ah, swim team. Intellectual stuff. So tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Does get, that fuel I, your filthy little fantasies? Gary, just get out of the way. Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or wait, do you like the boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? I see you guys are getting along as usual. I'm just toughening ow, him up. Ow. Turning him into a man or a woman or something. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Petey. Ah, oh, peace stain. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. And I've got a weak bladder. Oh, I think the bullies might have gotten him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good chance to show Russell who's in charge around here. Now run along, Ow! peace stain, before you mark the carpet. Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go help that door. And what are you going to do? I've got planning to do. Knock it off. <laughs> Sorry. <Boop>. Stop. <laughs> Sorry.
Oh, what are you, a wimp, Bucky? I'm gonna make you and your boy. I thought I was your sidekick. Oh, God, my ribs. Bucky, I'm you're pathetic. Dead. You're dead. Oh. I got like Come in handy. We are buddies. What's the deal? Damn it, kids! Keep it down. Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. Thanks, Jimmy. That's great. Here, take this. Hopkins comes through. So big now, are you? All right, you know the drill. Do the assignment and be quiet. I'll just be sitting here drinking my tea. Good show. Well done. That's right. Keep it up. Well done. Good show. I don't think that's in the dictionary. That has to be some sort of slang, yes? I'm afraid I can't give that a passing grade. You're a complete waste of space! Give it back. Or what? Or, well, just give it back. Are you threatening <gasps> me, Metal Mouse? No, I just, just give it back. You can't just steal things from me. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. Chow spotty. Give it back. And you should stay out of the girl's dorm, you little perv. I see you undressing me with your eyes, sicko. You wish. Please, will you help me? Do I have to? Yes, it's vital. She's stolen my lab notes. Without them, I'm gonna fail chemistry and I'll never get into med school. Now I won't find the cure for cancer. Basically, the future of the whole world rests on those notes. What's in it for me? Well, if you get them back, I'll... I'll kiss you. Ugh. 
Uh, that's okay. Oh, oh, okay, but if you don't, I'll tell the whole school you're some kind of sad sicko who spies on girls getting changed in their dorm. Relax. One set of lab notes coming up. Hey, Gary, I need to get something from Mandy's locker. I'm not surprised. You know, you should put a stink bomb in there. It'd be funny. Get one from Fatty. He knows everything about stinking. One time I spread a rumor about a girl. Nobody gives me a wedgie Looking today. good, my man. Here you go. Oh, Jimmy, thank you. You're wonderful. You smell real good. Thank you for being my partner for this uh, project. I mean, what do you have? Nerd? Oh. <laughs> How original. <laughs> Call me a nerd. What next? Four eyes? Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt All me. All right, you oh. ass boy. What's this? Class <laughs> press -dent. Class president, dummy. It says class president. I don't know. That's I you? Know. I'm the most suitable candidate I know. <laughs> yeah, so's your mom. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> oh, no. Don't forget to wipe. <laughs> How's the campaign, Ernest? You'll vote for me, won't you? Yeah, 
Not a chance. What if I pay you? Pay me? Now you're talking. I always knew I was a born leader. <laughs> yeah, but unless you buy everyone's vote, you're never gonna win. Because they are definitely gonna ruin your speech at the debate. Oh. 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 Unless I had a security manager. Oh, oh, please, please, please. I don't please, know. Security please, managers, they please. cost a lot of money. Oh, I have money. I can pay you. Good. I've always been a politician at heart. Did you ever have to hide from the job? I'm going to... You're going to wish you What's had a bodyguard! Welcome. What are you looking at, huh? I won't mince words, my friends. This school needs help. You couldn't beat a fly. My help. Ouch! Look on That's this. just not right. How many of you out hey, there feel you suck. abused by society? Let down you by the establishment? Brutalized. I feel your pain, my children. Do you like it, you prick? Do not despair. You suck. Salvation is here, ass. my friends. What's up, maggot? By choosing me as your Our leader, your door. we will usher in a new Why era of cry? education. Hey, stop no. it! Abuse Excellent job, artist! Teaching! Gone! Physical hey, education! You gone! You suck! I'm gonna kick your ass! Hey. I'm with Run you, with Artemis! Bulwark will be the model for a pure academic hey, curriculum. Money no longer wasted Excellent on job, silly artist. musicals or crafts. Sit on this, you prick! I'm gonna make you swallow this! My opponent I'm with you, you believed. You couldn't beat a fly. But your sports right are more meaningful for your Dumb future man. than decent textbooks and Wait. competent teachers. Your fly's undone. What have sports done for you? Dumb man. Cause pain and you misery. Like you, fruit. you scrawny little puke. While my opponent may also be more popular. Suck on this! Good looking and muscular. I'm gonna whip you, huh? And have the attention of the school bimbos. You scrawny little puke! He just doesn't have what it takes to be I'm president! Cake. There are some who claim I don't Pancake. represent the masses. You suck! Let me tell you. Come here with you, huh? Ow! Why is this happening? I've been beat up just as much as you. It's time for change for the better. Careful, wimp! A vote for Ernest means a vote for... In closing, remember, a vote for E... means a vote for me. Thank you, everyone. Good night. Glad that's done. Your help, Junior. Evening, sir. You, boy! What do you think you're doing? Nothing. What about you? Well, I'm, uh, uh, I, I, I'm looking for naughty boys. I, I mean, I'm looking for naughty boys in the wrong parts of town. 
What I mean, Hopkins, is that I'm glad to report that in that disgusting store, I did not find one naughty boy. Not one. Well, that's good, sir, because filth like that can really rot a young man's mind. Exactly! That's why I got this research, to check on the dangers. It's good to see a teacher so dedicated to his work, sir. Thank you! No problem. But I'll tell you, Hopkins, I'm quite worn out with all this work. I don't, uh, suppose you could do me a favor. What? Well, uh, how do I put this? I'm in charge of the laundry this week, but I got so carried away with my research that I forgot to collect it all at the same time. <laughs> it would be embarrassing to ask for it now. Oh, uh, maybe you could help, but you'll uh, have to be discreet. Discretion is my middle name, sir. Great! So go and collect all the dirty laundry from the, uh, girls' dorm. Okay. And if you get caught, I know nothing about it. I won't say anything, sir. In fact, I'll make it clear that I never saw you coming out of an adult store clutching illicit magazines. Good boy! Now hurry up and bring them to me by the school gates, but... Shh! I'll see you soon, Jimmy. Pretend you don't know it's curfew. Get going. on to that. Score! I'm just gonna collect this. Not too bad. Hey, if I get that A, my mom will be so disappointed. I really love you. Somebody help! There's a pervert in here! Is that Jimmy? Girls, please keep quiet. We're being what? What do you think you're doing here? Get out of the girl's dorm. I wonder what anyone is doing. What's he doing in here?
going to beat you now. I will beat you for that. I hope these are worth all the trouble I just went through. Yes, thanks for this laundry. Here's some money for your troubles. There was never any doubt. You think you're bad, huh? Hopkins, I really love trashing you. Thanks for shopping with us. Have a nice day. This might come in handy. I Lay off! Keep that up. I must request that you leave the... Look, there he is. I was wondering if you'd show up, Hopkins. Nice Aquaberry sweater. Trey Sheep. <laughs> yeah. Wow. You look a bit like my gardener at home. Yeah, so what? Yes, well, enough <laughs> about gardeners or any domestic help. Listen, me and the champs were planning a little revenge hit on old Hat Trick. We don't like what he did to that old Soak Galloway. A chap could have a drink if he bloody hell wants to. So? <laughs> So, my friend, are you, as they say, in? Sure. Are you English? Well, no. I just speak this way because I'm very insecure. You see, my father is a self-made man, so I pretend to be old money, but in fact, I'm really nouveau riche. But less about me, dear boy. Listen, we're going to egg that old Kaja's house. Cool. Smashing! You go get some eggs and meet me and the chaps back at my house. Got the eggs, Hopkins? You bet. Then give them to me. Take them. Smashing. Now tell me, Hopkins, is it true you said I was inbred? No, because first cousins is legal, my friend. Legal. Yeah, okay. Yeah, and just because my elder brother doesn't have a chin and ended up in a lunatic asylum, it doesn't mean anything. Whatever, Tad. Your family is your business. Don't lie, Jimmy. You said Tad was probably a hermaphrodite with that much inbreeding. A hermaphro what? Don't act dumb. You said his mom was also legally his aunt, and that he probably had webbed toes. I don't. Well, just only on one foot. Tad, you're not gonna take that kind of crap from this scumbag, are you? You've... you... You've been rude about mommy! Let's get this, Papa! Inbred, oh, am you're I? You're awfully uppity. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
Hey, Pete. Where is everybody? Oh, Jimmy, it's you. Yeah? I guess you want to kill Gary now that he's turned most of school against you and got those rich kids to throw eggs at you. Gary will get what's coming to him. What's wrong with you? Nothing. Well, you're sitting around watching TV by yourself like a loser. Someone crap in your bed? What's wrong? Well, for one moment, I had friends. Just one moment. You and Gary. Yeah, Gary's a snake, and you're a psychopath. Ah, come you on. You both bullied me mercilessly, but... At least I wasn't left out. And now I'm back on my own, and I'm too cool to be a dork, and I'm too dorky to be anything else. You're not on your own. Where is everybody? At the bike race at Old Bullworth Vale. My shiny bike's at the beach. Bike race? Why didn't you say so? Come on. You pathetic wretches! <laughs> Don't make What's me laugh! What's your team called? The Unvaluables? I'll put you in your place.
job. Sweet win. Come by and see me anytime. I'll have your trophy. Nice work, Jimmy. Yeah, you want to get a C-785. Then dismantle it and recouple with a 767 in titanium. Very expensive, but it will make your machine fly. That's what the pros do. Really? I was gonna get the 976 because I thought it would make me look important amongst my peer group. A 976? What are you, a girl? Oh, here's the kid who won the race. Hey. You came for your trophy, huh? Yep. Here she is. Beautiful. Molded plastic, covered in aluminum wrap, with your name misspelled on it. Excellent. Great. Look at this. A bunch of guys whose career aspirations are to work in stores. Fabulous. I love it when people know their place in life. <laughs> <laughs> well, your place in life is in my toilet, you trust fund turd. Do you even have flushing toilets in your trailer? I couldn't imagine it. You guys are a bunch of scumbags, aren't you? What you got? Bring it, come on. Nice trophy. Here, let me see. Come on, hey, <laughs> give me that back! I'm afraid I have to beat I'm gonna you. I'm going to break your chain. I'll do better next time, Dad. I, I promise. That's that nonsense dealt with. I bet you can't beat my swimming record. You just don't have the poise. Hello? You, boy, don't just stand there. Come and help. What do you want, sir? Why did you send for me? I sent for you? Oh, yes, I did. Look at that plant, boy. Magnificent, isn't it? A crapula maxima fortissima. A rare and precious Venus flytrap. Unfortunately, there is a boy at this school, Darby Harrington, who was given such a plant from his father. His father is not a nice man. Darby is not a nice boy. They keep that plant to belittle my collection. There are two sides to biology, boy. Life and death. Do I make myself clear? Very clear, sir. You want me to kill Darby Harrington? Yeah, I'll get right on that. Not the boy, boy! The plant, boy! Kill the plant! Oh, right.
Hey, buddy. Sure thing. Well, I'm going to work at my father's firm this summer. He's making him What a bastard. So I asked mother, why can I exercise? I mean, I'll be 18. All right, bar with Biff. It's quite good. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Think I'm dumb? <laughs> Who's dumb now? I'm dumb, I'm dumb, real dumb. Hey, hey, kid, hey, kid, help me out, please. Easy, Russell. <laughs> calm down, calm down. <laughs> Sit. Good boy. Thank you. Thank you. Jeez, that dumb kid's really strong. Dumb? Hey, be good. No. Be good. Not you, Einstein. Not you. So, how did everything work out with those eggs? Not like I was hoping. Never trust a rich kid. Too bad. Too bad. Was it that jerk, Tad? You know, his parents are at a party at my boss's house right now. If he wanted a revenge thing, now would be a good time. I guess I'll need some more eggs then. Ah, yes. You got it. Thanks. Come on, Russell. We've got a house call to make. Up. 
Who threw that egg? I know you're out there. Oh, no! I'm a saving maple fork! Dear God, it's all over the wall! Someone find him! Another job well done. They just don't understand. Did I make myself clear? All right, kids. I'm in a good mood today, so just shut up and get to work. All right. You're getting somewhere now. I guess you're not useless. Not too shabby, Hopkins. Shutting up and working? It works. Okay, see you next time, Jim. Job well done. I can Sir, use that. Please help. Have you ever been to a sunken pirate ship? I bet there's something really cool out there. So how do I do it, Pete? Do what? Beat those rich kids into submission. Well, what have you tried so far? Random violence, widespread destruction, gratuitous sadism. No, no, that's not gonna work. They get all that kind of stuff at home. No, what you gotta do is you gotta beat one of them publicly. You gotta prove to them you're better than their best man. Why don't you box that dumb jerk Biff? Not bad, Pete. Not bad at all. All right, see you around. Wait, Jimmy, can I come too? You know what? Don't worry about it. You and me, Biff. You and me what? You and me, the noble art of boxing. May the best man win. And then you little trust fund fairies will know what life is all about. Anytime, Popper. Of course, the best man always wins. Me. Come on. Afterwards, you can clean my shoes. watching Biff hurt people. Go, oh, Biff! I'm counting on you!
wonder Hopkins is still standing. I can do so much better, you know. I've got a lot of money to bet on it. Who's the baddest? Me. Who's the toughest? Me. Who's the man? Me. Me, losers. Me. The champion number one. I killed the best. I will beat the rest. Yeah. What have we got wrong. here? That That's poor right. kid just beat yeah. up Biff. He's our new it. champion. Just... What? He is That's the right. new champion. Yeah, come on. Come on, man. Woo! You uh, disgust me. Uh, 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 uh. It takes more than victory to become a champion. It takes breeding and nepotism and snobbery. You filthy Democrat. Gentlemen, are we going to let some gutter snipe come in and beat up our friend Biff? No! Then what are we going to do? Beat him back to the ghetto! Yeah! yeah! You guys soften him up. I'll get a drink. Get back, man. You ignorant pauper, get over here. Wretch, hiding behind your friends. I'm leveraging the assets I have, and you don't. Friends. Just shut up, Darby. Here's some more tactics for you, poor boy. Get that buffoon out of here. Flying around everywhere. <laughs> Who's the boss now? I can't hear you, rich kids. Who's the boss now, my waspy little friend? Answer the question. You are... Louder! You are... Uh, That's right. Me. Now you girls, learn to play nice. You understand? Now, Darby is really stupid, malevolent, and rich. So it will surprise none of you to discover in a future life, he'll end up in Congress. But this is my story, not his. With the trust fund babies under control, it's time to turn my attention to their sworn enemies, those greaseball kids. So, you must be pretty proud of yourself. You taught those rich scum a lesson. They're rich, weak bullies. It was easy. They picked a fight with me, and I showed them who was boss. And Gary got them to pick that fight, so maybe you'll show him as well. Gary's an even bigger problem. He'll have to wait. Hey! What's this throwback want? A haircut? A nice strong man to cuddle up to? Who knows? Jimmy Hopkins, right? My friend Johnny needs your help. Then tell your friend Johnny to come and ask for it. Nobody tells Johnny anything. Johnny Vincent does the telling. Well, he doesn't tell me what to do. Now beat it, greaseball. You're causing an oil slick. I said he needs your help, man. Do I look like a charity service? You're gonna pay for this. What is wrong with this place? Everyone here either needs help, wants to beat you up, or both. Well, you know who Johnny Vincent is, though, don't you? No, and I don't care. He's head of the greaser clique. Get friendly with him, and he can help you get to Gary. Yeah, maybe. I'll tell you something, Pete. This place blows. Tell me about it.
Everyone's laughing. <laughs> oh. This is a joke, right? Dr. Crabble Snitch does not. Hello, miss. Oh, there you are, Jimmy. I'll make this quick. Your mom has sent you a Christmas present. Just great. I know. You are very lucky your mom is so nice. You may go now. Frickin' Hopkins. Where's your man. uniform, young Hopkins? You know your I hate having to do, having that, to do right? this. <laughs> Of course I love you, Johnny. No, you don't. Love is complicated. That didn't seem complicated between you and that Gordo kid. I'm gonna kill him. Johnny, please. We've been over that. He's sweet, but it was so innocent. Get off. Oh, I love it when you get angry, Johnny. I really do. You're so bestial. Hey, Jimmy. Hey. What are you doing here? Looking for you, Johnny. At Lola's house? Yeah. Be nice to each other. You know what I like about you two? You're both so straightforward, so quick to judge, so fast. Ain't no one fast like me. Really? So you could beat Jimmy in a race? Definitely. I heard he was pretty fast. This little twerp? Give me a break. Oh, I think we've got a little challenge. I just love challenges. They make me so excited. We don't have to worry about this, this bunch of mama's of boys kids. got nothing. You got no chance against Johnny and his boys.
All right, Jimmy, you won. Well, of course, my bike wasn't tuned right. I'm gonna head to the shop and do some work on it. More bike talk? I'll meet you guys later. You have nice lips. Wasn't that great? Another good deed done. Get ready to be pounded down like a nail. Hey, good looking. What's up? Oh, you're so angry. But I think you've got a softer side. Haven't you caused enough trouble? That's not fair. I'm a nice girl. I'm nice to everyone. Now everyone hates me. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry. Well, OK. But now Johnny and his boys won't even speak to me. Boys can get really jealous when they find out you've been kissing another boy. It wasn't like that. I'm not like that. OK. But I left all my things in the abandoned tenements where they hang out. My address book, my keys, my perfume, my lipstick, even my laundry. Everything. Now I've got nothing. I don't have much money. That's too bad. Maybe you could get them back for me? You want me to steal your stuff back from a bloodthirsty mob of angry greaseballs? I'd be very grateful, Jimmy. <laughs> very grateful. I dumped it in the river. No one knows. Everything good. This away. All right. You bought a oh. ticket for the pain train. Oh, the <laughs> hey, come closer. You're gonna get creamed. Sometimes I wonder what I get for my parents to send me here. Before you get hurt. Boys, it's Jimmy. Oh. I'm gonna smoke your butt with my boot.
Hey, there's tracks nearby. You're on the wrong side of it. Looks like I'm a little rusty. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing here? Um, uh, taking out the trash. Looks like that's what I have to do. I just love wrecking things with my hammer. Gotta use the right tools for the job. An armed society is a polite society. Might find a use for that. show you. <laughs> you speared my lipstick, you beast! <laughs> I'm good. That's all there is to it. So, I need your help. There he is, my hero. What's your problem now? If you really cared about me, you'd fight for me. First of all, I'm not sure I really care about oh. you. And second, what do you think I've been doing? Tad fights for me, Gord fights for me, Johnny... Well, he certainly fights for me. In fact, they're all about to fight for me. Right now. 
everyone apart from you. Who's fighting? Tad and all the rich kids are coming here to fight Johnny and his boys. All because of me. I'm like Helen of Troy. So there's gonna be a big fight? A winner-take-all sort of thing? Yes, everyone's involved apart from you. I'm Helen of Troy, and you're more interested in boys called Troy. Whatever. See you later. Johnny is so I can finish him off. I know where he is, but I ain't telling you nothing. You go for the ticket for the main yeah. train. Choo -choo. Let me clean that spot on your face. Don't even think about touching the hand. Come on, hero. Walk tall, don't you? Let me Come on, hero. Look at that. Walk tall, don't you? Not so big now, are you? Who won? Me, <coughs> Jimmy Hopkins, that's who. Who won? You. Who? <coughs> Jimmy Hopkins. Correct. <coughs> that's right, ladies. Me. I'm the daddy now. You treacherous little snake. You think you're tough, huh? You don't need any more of this, Johnny. You laugh at me, you turn on me, you get it on with that harlot who I, I love. Uh, I'm gonna destroy you! All right, calm down, man. It's cool. You lost. No big deal. We can all be friends. You're done, kid. Finished! You'll learn to keep your hands off my girl! Get out of here! The car! You're lucky, Jimmy. I'll kick your ass later. Get back here! The front! Let's go! Jimmy, help me get to the crane. Open wide. 
right, boys, good work. I got him where I need him. Watch out, Jimmy. the daddy got it i'm in charge you do what i said all right i give up you can have her who what are you talking about johnny lola you win she's yours this has nothing to do with her man i don't care you can keep that slut for yourself what you don't want her then why did you do this why'd you fight just to prove you're tougher than me that's right and don't you or your boys forget it i'm tougher than you so maybe now you'll stop bullying everyone you work for me now oh man I'm starting to feel pretty good about myself. I've just taken control of two of the school's worst cliques, but I know there are bigger problems just around the corner. Problems with overdeveloped pituitary glands and brains the size of peas. The thing is, Pete, now that I'm cool, I'm not sure we can be friends anymore. What? I'm messing with you. <sighs> Real funny, Jimmy. Well, when you're done with this place, a career on the stage awaits. Maybe, maybe like a male stripper or something, huh? What? Uh, <clears throat> so, um, what about Gary? I haven't seen him. But whenever I hear somebody say I used to be a girl and had a sex change, or that my mother slept with Crabble Snitch to get me in here, I think to myself, Gary. Gary! What a jerk! You don't even call me a dork. Well, I guess he's not always wrong. Is that what you really think? <sighs> Whatever, Jimmy. You know, I stand up for you, and you still think I'm a dork. You're a jerk. And you're a dork, so we're equal. Whatever. I'm leaving. Ow! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now maybe oh. next time you'll watch where you're going. What'd you do that for? Oh, Ouch. I'm sorry, Psycho. Did oh. I hit your boyfriend? Yes, yeah, Psycho. You gonna try to kick our asses now? No, I think I'll do that more publicly. Ooh, I'm really scared right now. Really scared. Ooh. I take down oh. linebackers every day, oh. pal. Whatever, pretty boy. You'll get yours. <laughs> yeah, we'll see about that. Go have some fun in the communal showers. Ooh, I just dropped my soap. Please pick it up for me. Dead. Losers. Petey, get up. Jimmy, Jimmy, I think we found some new people to have some fun with. Hey, Jim, I got some homework to do. If you're ever in doubt what to do, it's best to keep your mouth shut and keep working. So get to it. All right, you're getting somewhere now. I guess you're not useless. Not too shabby, Hopkins. Shh. 
Shutting up and working? It works. Good work, Hopkins. Not too shabby, Hopkins. Okay, son, you've learned what there is to learn. Anytime you want to come tool around, you're welcome to. I'm awesome. Another job well done. Much better. Now I'm ready to dazzle everyone with my charisma and popularity again. Sweet! Got some nice pictures oh, for you. I can't wait to see them. I'm an avid student of anatomy, you know. All right. One day they'll all be. Very well, young squire. Huh? How are you, young man? Can I offer you a highball? Yeah, sure. Actually, maybe you're a little young. Better keep this out of harm's way. <sighs> are you gonna be all right, sir? Uh, it's that pompous ass hat trick. He's bad-mouthing me all around the staff room. Why? He keeps calling me a drunk. Says that I am irresponsible. He's trying to get me fired. He's trying to turn Miss Phillips against me. Well, sir, when people say bad things about what I do, I like to prove them wrong. Really? How? By showing a nobler side of yourself? Rising above it? No, not exactly. I like to show that they massively underestimated the force that they were dealing with and then really give them something to complain about. Ah, oh, the treacherous Machiavelli, I love it. Good, me too. You're a complete you waste Hi. of space. Jeez. Troublemakers will be... Uh, it's been fun, but I have to go lower my heart. <laughs> What a god of freedom is going on out there! You 
one is going to pay for this. I'm done. Why can't they have fun? I wish it... Jimmy, you've interrupted me. Oh, sorry. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Can I see? Sure, take a look. I think I have finally caught the essence of what it means to be a banana. I really feel my work is moving forward. Uh, here's the thing. Art is lost on me. I've always been more into music. You know, having thoughts for another really makes your work glow. Uh, how do you mean? When people do things, incredible things, when people blossom and grow, that really moves me. You know what I mean? Not really. <laughs> I am in love, Jimmy. And I want to make tonight very special. Would you mind going to collect a few things while I work my muse out? A dress, some perfume, my pearl necklace from the jewelers, not too much. I must look my best tonight. Tonight? Wow, of course. Is this legal? Of course it's legal. Whatever can you mean? Now go on, my dear. Hurry! I have to be... Oh, hey! Okay.
Hey, Look how you this. doing? I'm all geared up to crack ready to put some real damage! Hello, I'm here to help you if you need it. I was just looking for... Why is this stuff lying around everywhere? Got my eye on you. So much stuff just lying around. Here you go. Oh, Jimmy, what took you so long? Thanks. No problem. Oh, man, I can't believe this. My first time with a teacher. Oh, man, this is gonna be great. Hey, Jimmy, what are you doing here? Nothing. What are you doing here? Ah, uh, well, it's a little awkward, but since you've been such a good friend to me, Ms. Phillips, she's asked me, me, of all people, she, can you believe? She's asked me on a date. Wait, she asked you? I think you're mistaken. Uh, what? Yeah, I mean, I think there's been some sort of mistake. You sure you haven't been hitting the bottle again? No. I mean, yes, I am sure. Well, okay then. Hitting bottle. <sighs> Lionel, you came. You look great. So do you, Deirdre. Thank you. Wait, what? Jimmy, what are you still doing here? Uh, what do you mean? This boy is an angel. He's been magnificent. Uh-huh. And he is so cute. Cute. <laughs> nice. Come on, Lionel. Let's go. Bye, Jimmy. Jimmy, you should get back to school. Wait, Miss Phillips. Ah, oh, man. What are you doing? Let's be friends, but don't anger the Watcher.
Man, the last thing we need is some sort of watcher stampede again. I must be a better person. I must be a better person. I must be a better person. Oh, God! I am pathetic! Hey, Mr. Galloway. Go away! I don't want to have another group therapy session with those people. If I have to pretend to be someone's mother one more time, I'll... Oh. Hi, Jimmy. Uh, what on earth are you doing here? Ms. Phillips sent me. She's really worried about you. Come on, let's get out of here. Oh, uh, uh, what? <laughs> I can't right now, Jimmy. I'm late for my regression therapy as it is. It's fantastic. I've discovered I really do hate myself. Patrick was right. I am a loser. No, you're not. Don't be ridiculous. Come on, we can't let bullies like Mr. Hattrick win. Okay, Jimmy. Jimmy, I really appreciate this. Thank you. Me too. I am so happy to have my galley bear back. Galley bear? And done. Oh, hey, Jimmy. Hey, Pete. Yo, Jimmy, I'm over here. Give me five, dude. Uh, no. <laughs> yeah, well, cat, looks like your homies took care of some lames for us. <laughs> what are you talking about? Don't get fresh with your homies. <laughs> Can you please talk normally? This is my normal style of rapping, bro. <laughs> All right, enough. What's my quest? Ah, right. Salutations, Sir James. It seems my clever brethren have taken control of the funhouse at the carnival. Well done. All that education and now you run a funhouse? Genius. You simple-minded noble foot soldier. <laughs> the football team is going to be there this afternoon. You could really cause them some problems. Okay, explain it to me on our way over. There's not much to explain. Just access the control rooms through the maintenance doors. Then do your thing. Cool. Moonwalk. Oh. Ooh. Uh, yeah. oh.
want to touch me. My smell is contagious. Here comes your pound cake. You're going downtown. You think no. I'm just gonna lie down and take it back to Here comes your pound ball. cake. <laughs> so Stop moving around. Come on, bark bag. I can take it. I'm so glad you got here, Jimmy. The jocks are taking over. You gotta get us out of here. something. I need some backup, please! Help Your me task out. is complete, brave knight. Thank you. 
Thanks! Your task is complete, brave knight. Oh, here he is, Mr. Big. Oh, can't you just get lost? Or help, we're trying to get out of here. Come on, Muscles. We've not got long. What are you talking about? The jocks are coming to kill us. Oh, thanks to you and your sordid little pictures. You wanted them. You're the sicko. Oh, a healthy interest in sexual matters is natural during puberty, bud. That's why I was having those dreams. Anyway, this is not important right now. I am about to die! We all are! When are they coming? What about your famous defense system? Oh, it's broken, okay? Can't you fix it? I need a bit of time. We have no time. We're dead! Dead! I love you, my friends! Look, you fix it, I'll hold up the jocks. Now, where's that gun thing? Get out of here, you We're sickos! We're coming in, you We're coming to get ready you. for you, nerds! Doomed! These feelings are natural, and I'm about to die for them! Just go fix the defense system, and I'll take care of the goons. Come on, you wimp! We're coming to get, get you! Get out of here, sickos! To the barricades! Jimmy, get to the spud cannon! It's our last chance! Hold them back with a barrage of potatoes, Jimmy! It's funny. I'm the girl in the dirty pictures. Ha ha. What are you talking about? Ugh, don't pretend you don't know. Everybody knows. Knows what? There's posters of me all over town. 
Oh, those. Now everyone thinks I'm a slut. Great, my parents will be so proud. I'll probably get expelled. Look, it could be worse. How? How exactly could it be worse? I mean, sure, I've been a bitch at times, been nasty, but I don't deserve this. My life is over. I mean, I've always wanted to be a model, but not like this. Everybody's laughing at me. I can't bear it. Everybody's always laughing at me. Well, maybe you're not as insecure as I am, okay? I just wanted to be popular. Now everybody hates me. Well, I guess I deserve it. I'll tell you what, you wait here. I'll get rid of those posters for you, or at least cover them up. Would you? I'd do it myself, but I can't deal with it. I'm really losing it here. Just hang in there. I think I've got some mayonnaise on my pants. Pig, stop me. Luckily, I have an almost unlimited supply of fresh posters. Welcome. Hope to see you soon. You want some more punk?
To give up your business in the hole. I dumped it in the river. No one knows. Someone who cares. Oh, you are the sweetest boy ever! Look in my eyes for a sec. Mm. Oh. Hey, Jimmy. I've had a brilliant idea. Another one. Many are called, but few are chosen. Luckily for you, I've chosen you to help me carry out this little masterpiece, my finest work. What are you talking about, you lunatic? I'm talking about what we're always talking about, amigo. About bullying the bullies. About my favorite dish, revenge. Revenge? Against who? Who do you think? The football team. Those overdeveloped, underbrained lords of our little manor. Reduced to a bunch of sniveling wretches bowing down to my... You mean our? I meant our superiority. <laughs> Us ruling like gentlemen over the peasants. Us? Us, yes. You ruling, of course. Me offering some sage advice. Doing all the thinking, that sort of thing. Merlin to your King Arthur. Whatever. What's the plan? Well, first, we need you to get the school mascot costume. And how do you suggest I do that? Well, go follow them. Wait for us to distract the gorillas. Go! While we still have hope! You don't mess with me, ever! I've got a piece of pound cake for you, win! Okay. You're such a bad way! I'm gonna make you Don't hard. get up next time! Come on, man! Leave me alone, Jerry! Looking good? What's your problem, man? Come on, man! Come on! How'd you like this, freak? How about this one? I can't believe I'm the mascot. You're pathetic. This is so cool. I'm gonna make you hurt. Stop that. You could've hit a truck. I'm gonna hit you till you love me. I'm gaining on you and it's only a matter of time now. You're such a good one. Come on, man. Call that hit. You're pathetic. Damon's the truth. How'd you like this, freak? How about this one? Take off! Looking good, dude! Help me, guys! I'm painting on you, and it's only a matter of time now. I'm You're gonna wish you weren't born! You could hit a I'm gonna make you bad. Leave me alone, Jerk! How you like this, freak? I can go all go day! Hey. You are so annoying! You're gonna wish you You're going hard. down! I'm gonna You're make you hurt! Looking good, we ladies. You don't want any of it. I'm gonna hurt I'm gonna break your face. I'm all state and beat Come down. on, man. I've got the strength of a bull, man. Back off. Up here, suckers. Nerds. What the? Whoa, what's all this?
Sometimes you just gotta take the bull by the horns. Glad that's done. You want some more time, punk? I'm a physical specimen. You can't outrun me. I'm gonna bust your gun up and watch you. Bleed. I'm a physical specimen. You can't outrun me. Yes, Candy from Ohio, you would be a fair queen for me in that little thong and with those massive piles of silicone. Initially, you'd think, who's that handsome stranger? Then I'd walk into the bar, impress you with my suavity. Um, my suavability? <laughs> uh, how suave I was! I'd look up and say, what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? And you'd say, take me to the hay barn. Hey, Ernest. <laughs> what's that oh, you're reading? Oh, nothing. Nothing. Just some, some history homework. <laughs> cool. Can I see? It's personal. <laughs> personal history. Sounds interesting. Yes. Well, you wouldn't understand. Anyway, listen. The big game is today. Operation Trojan Cow is ready to proceed. Operation Trojan Cow. It's my master plan. My spies have already been gathering the information that will bring about the downfall of the jocks at this school. So I guess I'll be needing this. Does this work? Yes. Rendezvous with my agents in the field. I must set you a task to prove yourself worthy. Time to dance, and you better not mess up. I love it, dude. You're so dorky. Patrols are everywhere. We are in grave danger at this very moment. You're in grave danger of a knuckle sandwich if you don't get on with it, that's what. Here's a ball we've rigged. Get to the shed by the field and swap it for the real game ball. Come on, you can do it!
come this way. Interception! a sticky situation on the team benches. Get it? <laughs> sticky situation. Yeah, I got it. Hey, mascot, do that awesome dance you do. Wow. I mean, whoa, whoa. game will be good, but not as good as wrestling match. <laughs> Funny <laughs> joke. around before I lose my patience and hurt you? <laughs> no, but it'll do. Okay, here's the deal. The jocks keep their game sports drink in a cooler. Go urinate in it. Enhance it, if you will. There's a rumor that someone is gonna screw up the game. This is too much for me. Yuck! Like, Vicky, <laughs> yuck! <laughs> That's like totally grody! Your quest, young Jimmy, is perilous, but the rewards are glorious. Cut the crap, Melvin. It was sort of funny the first 20 times, but it's getting old now. Scatter them over the football field. Ah, <laughs> uh, all right.
Hey, Jimmy. Nice outfit. Yeah, I know. Shows off my figure, doesn't it? But enough about me. How do I mess up those jocks? Straight to business, eh? Okay. There's a switch box on the scoreboard on the field. Get to it and switch it. Sounds easy. What will it do? It'll change the text of the scoreboard. I reprogrammed it. You'll like it. The jocks won't. Who is that Kim? Yeah, who is that Kim? Oh, it's that little Squirt Hopkins. Yeah, that Squirt Hopkins. You're dead, Hopkins. Yeah, dead, Hopkins. Why don't you stop repeating everything he says and get on with it? It's Jin Jing, Tom. I'm gonna lay wood on you. Screen left! Go, go, go! Right. 
allowed the captain to take Screw out the yourself, team. Noodle arm. I'm gonna put your face in the back of your head when I catch you. You couldn't hit a truck, you prick. That's right, losers! Yeah! Oh, Jimmy, you did it! You did it! I'm king of the school! Oh, you beat them all in front of everybody! Thanks for your help, Petey. Oh, this is gonna be great! So here I am, suddenly the king of the school. I never meant for things to turn out this way. I just wanted to control a couple of psycho kids and be left alone. But now I guess I'm certainly going to live the good life. Hey, Darby! Hey, Johnny. Hi, yo, Jimmy. what's up, brother? Hey, Jack. So I'm like, yo, it's Jimmy! <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, you're funny, man. Yo, you man, so what's funny, going on? Jimmy? Oh, hey, girl, you're looking great. Ooh. Great. Thank you for that show, <laughs> Darby. Oh, wow, hey, Jimmy! Oh, yeah. oh, boys, that's all I got to say. Later. So, Bye, Jimmy. Jimmy. See you later. I love that guy. Bye, guys. Let's roll. Pete! Hey, Jimmy, what's going on? Everything. I did it, man. I took over this dump. These morons are my morons That's now. great. Just don't turn into a jerk. How could I? I? Hey, baby. How you doing? What you doing later? Just remember, Jimmy, not everybody likes you. Correct. They love me. Well, what about Gary? Gary? Forget about that twerp. Dude, it's me now. I run this place and you're my friend, so please try to be cool. Oh, man, you're bringing me down. Come on, let's go milk this thing for all it's worth. We might even find you a girl. Watch it! <laughs> this is the greatest! Your trousers are kind of flattering. Hey, Jim, I got some homework to do. Hi! Gary's been telling me all sorts of crazy things about hockey. You hear about the nerds? They You're hitting yourself again. Thank you, yeah, <sighs> Idiot! Hey. Can't wait to watch the game. Talk to you another time. <laughs> 